All of our predator investigations have been predicated on the idea that teenagers are willing and sometimes eager to share very personal information online. Well, what are kids really up to on the computer? They may not always want to tell you, but they did tell us in a new nationwide survey. It comes down to one simple rule, experts say. Kids online should mean parents on alert. If you could actually look through cyber glasses and see who's peering in your window, who's reading your daughter's blog, who's cyber stalking your son, it is reality. Do teens let strangers into their online world? In a survey conducted by the intelligence group, Dateline questioned 500 teenagers across the country, ages 14 to 18, about their computer habits. When asked if they chat online to people they've never met before, an overwhelming majority said yes, whether it's all the time, sometimes, or not very often. When asked if someone they've met online has wanted to meet them in person, 58% said yes, and 29% said they had a scary experience online. What about personal information, tools a predator can use like a name, a picture, an address, a birthday? When asked if they talk about personal information on the Internet, about half the teens said yes, they do. We also asked if they did things online they would not want their parents to know about. Again, about half said yes. More than 90% told us that they were responsible when they used the computer. But what about friends, classmates, other teens? The answer, a big no. Most said other teens are not behaving responsibly online, which should be a red flag to parents. Where are you at? And that brings us back to the parade of suspected predators in Ohio. Next week we'll return to the heartland. What's going to happen when some of the men you've seen tonight appear in court? Okay, the maximum penalty uh, is up to 12 months in prison. Also, we'll expose more suspects looking to meet young teens. That's our boy. He's here. This man says he's innocent, but his story is especially frightening. What then are you doing in this house? less than a week before you're supposed to be in court and go to prison for doing the very same thing.